Hi and welcome. Uh, in this presentation, I want to give the um, let you see what it looks like to look at a cave here. What is a cave and what is not a cave? Right here in this particular presentation, this is typically what a cave will look like. Now, in the Visualizer 3D software, when you're running a Rover or a Rover C2 or Rover Deluxe, you do your automatic scan and you save it to the memory. You're going to do one straight line. And that straight line is going to come all the way down through here and you're not going to turn. When you come on a cave you will see that it will drop and there is a significant drop and then it will continue back to pretty much nothing. So when you're doing that you're going to set your impulses per scan line to 2 and then you're going to import your software or download the software download the measurement from your unit into the Visualizer 3D software. And let me just go and pull another one up here to show you what one looks like when there's nothing there. This is a long scan. So when you see that there's nothing there, it'll pretty much show you that you're going to get pretty much neutral all the way throughout here. We hit a little bit of mineralization. This could actually be a target. You could go back and look at that again. Um, and then that's where that is. One thing to note, and this is pretty important here. Let me move this just a hair over. And you're going to see here right at the very end that there seems to be a target here. When you have a target right at the very end of a scan, regardless if, it's, regardless if it's in one corner or if it's in another corner, this area right here, caution, be very careful. This can be an, an error simply because of the fact you're turning off the machine. You're coming to a stop and you're getting ready to rotate the machine and you're turning it off. If you get this and you think that there may be something, go back to this point. Make this happen over here in the middle. But don't leave it over here at the end and think, oh, I have something. Because if you do that, most likely you don't. And when there is nothing there, as you can see in this scan here, with nothing, it's just that you have absolutely nothing here. I'm just increasing the height lines here. So if there's nothing, this is what you're going to be looking at. Again, this here, you may want to look at it as a possible target, some mineralization maybe, but I don't know. Uh, another way of looking at this scan is going at a oblique view. You can see here, there's pretty much nothing. Going back over into here, this is what a tunnel typically looks like. Okay, as you're going to come down across the line, it's going to dip and drop into here. And this is a typical example of what a tunnel is going to look like. I hope that this helps.